Hello, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to add credit card to your Audible account. It's very simple. First thing I'd like you to do is to launch your Audible account. And how do you create one? Launch in a browser of your choice. Pretty much simple. In the search bar, which is usually at the top corner of your screen, type audible.com and that's going to take you to the official website for Audible. Once you get right there, follow through the on-screen prompt to create your account. And once you're done creating your account successfully, it's going to take you to this fantastic home page where you can now explore a lot of features to have an exciting time on Audible. So now that we're here, let's hop into today's text, which is how to add credit card to Audible account. From this home page, you're going to see a lot of subheadings. Library from the left to the right, library, wish list, plans and price and browse. And in the top right corner, you're going to find hi, add your name there, and then zero credits available, help. English. If you have credits, of course, it's going to be added there. But then, this is a new account, so you have to play for the available thingy. So, head over to where it says, Hi, Amy, move your cursor right there, do not click. Now, you're going to start a standard menu that says account details, pre orders, my returns and reviews, member benefits, how to leasing, leasing history, not Amy. Get it. Get out. So, sorry, sign up. Now, click on account details, and then it's going to open you up to the account overview page. Where you see a lot of features and settings that you can now explore, of course, and you can tweak to whatever you want. So that page is opening up. I don't know what's taking time, it's supposed to take time. So just have to ensure the internet connection is firm to accept this. Ta da! Now we're here. So head over to the left corner, you're going to find a few more options. Membership details, credit summary, payment settings, um, listening history, purchase history, gift history, notifications, okay? So from here, just head over to payment. Mm. Click on that and then the payment window is just going to open up. Here is where you can now add your um, credit card. So this is it. So right here in the space where it says card number, just add your credit card number and then enter the expiration date for your credit card, the month, and the year. And then full name as it appears on your credit card. And then the country, of course, where you're in. And then your address line one, which is very necessary. Line two is not necessary. All right. And then enter your zip code and then your state. And then enter your city. Now, right below, it says use this card for other people membership and purchases. If you want to use your credit card, then that's fine. Go ahead and click the checkbox it's just going to turn blue but then if you don't want to just click it out and then just leave the checkbox empty and then the next option is to of course add a new payment and that's just going to be added as part of your um payment method so this is exactly how you can add your credit card to audible accounts it's very simple this way so go over to the tutorial from top to bottom to get acquainted with the steps and once you're done begin to go i hope this tutorial marvelously helped you search